In this tutorial, I will teach you how to do the euphoria effect using Photoshop. Let's get started. First, open the image that you would like to edit. I will use this photo as a reference. Now, Crop your image like how it was cut out on a TV show poster and adjust the size of the image. Once you're satisfied, go ahead and click a new fill or adjustment layer and select gradient. Here, change the angle of the gradient so it would be reflecting to the side. Then, change the color of the gradient to replicate the euphoria lighting. For this side, I will use a bright blue color. Listen. And change the opacity of the other side to zero. After that, change the blending mode to multiply and change the opacity to your liking. Now, Repeat the same steps, but make sure to put the gradient to the other side and use a darker blue color to the gradient. Once you're done, you can now add additional lighting, but this time we will use the brush tool. Create a new layer and with the paintbrush tool, Adjust the size of the brush and change the color of the brush to orange. Then, paint on the area where the orange lighting was located. Now, change the blending mode to whatever suits your image. Before this image, I will use overlay. Then, adjust the opacity to soften the lighting. Now, in the toolbar, select the eraser tool and make sure to increase the size of the brush and set the hardness to zero. Then, erase any hard edges from the lighting. You can also resize and reposition the lighting by hitting Ctrl T to transform and hold down Shift to free transform. Once you're satisfied, you can now repeat the same steps to add more lighting to the image and make sure to make a new layer for each lighting to adjust the settings separately. The color of the lightings that I added are pink and purple. Once you're satisfied, you can now add text using the Helvetica New Ultra Light font. And you're done. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell so that you can be updated whenever we upload new tutorials.